Four days after the attack against the Biblos Hotel in Sevare, many questions remain unanswered. On Monday, Al Jazeera received a statement by the group Al Murabitun which claimed responsibility for the attack. But sources close to the investigation said they believed it was the work of the Messina Liberation Front, another jihadist movement close to the Ansardine group. The police said they had found phone numbers and addresses on the bodies of the attackers. In this town situated just below northern Mali, life is slowly returning to normal. Today it's OK, but on Friday it was scary. We didn't go out. There was no market, nothing. Today the situation is normal. There's a lot of activity. People are feeling better. The hotel's siege lasted 24 hours. Four Malian soldiers were buried on Saturday. Five members of the UN mission were also killed, as well as four of the attackers. Al Murabitun, the group founded by Mokhtar Bel Mokhtar, had already claimed responsibility for the attack of a restaurant in the capital Bamako in March. Five people were killed, two Malians and three Europeans.